Welcome to Matthew's 30 in review and we're looking at new, new features in gameplay. The menus for FIFA 13 are pretty much the same as FIFA 12, as you can see. They're not really changed that much. And the seasons menus changed. But the team management and choosing the team hasn't changed that much. The ultimate team menus have changed a lot. As everything's all in different places, set out differently. New manager tasks. A new feature to FIFA 13 is the ES. FC match day. We can play as just a normal exhibition match, but you can play with the players that are in form and players that are out of form. Also, you can support your club. You can see where you rank so your XP catalog. It's a new feature. You can buy different things for to help you throughout your game. Also, new is skill games. Where you can improve your free kicks, passing, shooting, penalties, dribbling. And these are score, they have scores, you can do bronze, silver, gold, and then a skill game at the end. Rainbow menus are pretty much the same, except for you do international management. Changing your teams around are pretty much the same, FIFA 12. You can also request funds, look at your objectives for the league and cup. Browse other jobs that you could be likely to go to. You can also offer players in your transfer. For other players to swap deals and also have money to be more likely to get the player. The gameplay is a little bit different compared to FIFA 12 as the first touch in the game is a lot different as the players, low rated players have worse touch like FIFA 12. The impact energy has been taken on the game a little more so there's less players flying all over the pitch. Things messing up.